He laid his hand on her shoulders and gently it began to travel down the curve of her back to stroke the curve of her flank. She dried her face. Shall you come to the hood? He asked in a quiet, neutral voice. He drew her up and led her slowly to the hut. There he spread out a blanket. His face was pale. You lie there, he said softly. With a strange obedience, she lay down quite still, as if in a sort of dream, as his hand groped softly in the dark among her clothing. Yet the hand was knowing. Then, with a quiver of exquisite pleasure, he touched her warm, soft body. It was a moment of pure peace for him, the moment of entry into the body of a woman. She lay still, could strive no more. She did not begin to rouse till he had finished and lay softly panting against her breast. Then she wondered, just dimly wondered, why? Why was this necessary? Why had it given her peace? Was it real? The man lay in mysterious stillness. What was he feeling? What was he thinking?